रिकॉर्डिंग स्टार्ट इन फाइव फोर थ्री टू वन स्टार्ट इट हैज गिवन मी ग्रेट प्लेजर टू हैव बीन एबल टू विजिट द गोल्ड माइंस दिस मॉर्निंग आई हैव वंडर्ड अबाउट दिस कंट्री अ ग्रेट डील एंड आल्सो विजिटेड दिस स्टेट ऑन थ्री प्रीवियस ओकेजन्स बट आई हैव विजिटेड द गोल्ड माइंस फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम दिस मॉर्निंग यू कैन देयर फॉर इजिली अंडरस्टैंड how happy i am to have seen many things which i did not see before i had seen many many mines some of which operate in the state from which i come there i had seen coal mines copper mines iron mines mica mines and but i had not seen a gold mine because it does not exist elsewhere so it was a matter of real pleasure that i came here saw the working of the gold mines in your area in this country nature has endowed us with a great deal of wealth which is hidden in the bowels of the earth we have not been able so far to get a correct and exact picture of what there is under the earth the government is engaged in setting up some sort of an organization which will investigate and estimate our mineral resources work in this lane has been going on but it is intended so intensify it so that we may go ahead in this direction it is therefore a matter of congratulation that you are doing this kind of work and have been able to strike new fields which you consider to be quite satisfactory from the point of view of work and profit you have no reason to apprehend that the government will do anything which will stand in the way of the development of this important industry we are anxious to develop all our resources it takes a little time for all governments to make up their minds and especially when they have not all the necessary knowledge and information to enable them to form a correct decision on points i understand a committee has been appointed which is going to look into all the aspect of this question so far as these minds are concerned and i hope the recommendation of the committee will be such as well help further progress and development of these industries it is in the interest of the government it is in the interest of the workers it is in the interest of the companies so far it has given me great pleasure to go round the town which has grown up in this world place which you said at one time was nothing but barren rocks i have seen at jamshedpur and probably there are several other places like this where on account of development of modern industries townships have grown up and this is one of them where there were jungles before i think some of you might have seen jamshedpur jamshedpur was nothing but a dense jungle about 45 years ago 
it was then very largely inhabited by wild elephants in the same place we have today the biggest city in the province and the biggest steel factory in asia it often happens that one industry grows up in a particular place other subsidiary industries grow up along with it from the experience of jamshedpur i can say that you can also look forward to the development of other subsidiary industries in your area there are at jamshedpur i think more men employed in the subsidiary industries than in the main industry because we are as the main iron and steel works is one factory which of course is a very big factory there are large numbers of others industries round about the main factory and they all employ large numbers of workers our village folk although simple and mostly uneducated were able to pick up the technical work i believe that has been your experience also a considerable proportion of the labor population here comes from the madras presidency and other local areas the fact that the ordinary people are taking to modern industries gives us hope that our industries will prosper for once the problem of trained technicians is overcome the problem of finding organizing and directing skill will not present much difficulty in any case if necessary we could get such specialized talent from outside we are anxious for the growth of all industries i am sure you also realize that for the growth of industries it is necessary that our labor is contented and it feels secure if that is born in mind i am sure with your experience and skill you have no reason to fear that this industry would close down for want of support or that this place will once again be inhabited by lizard and jackals i am sure good willing wait will continue to prosper i think you all for the kindness shown to me and for taking me round and showing all the places i am particularly thankful to the people who have come out in their thousands on the road side to greet me